it's that last big getaway of the summer. Millions of Americans driving into a busy travel weekend ahead. I'm expecting a lot of traffic. We expect, yeah, a lot more people, a lot more crowds, uh, especially with a long weekend. AAA says bookings for domestic travel, including flights, hotels, rental cars, and cruises, are up 4% since Labor Day last year, and a whopping 44% rise in international bookings, with top destinations including Vancouver, Rome, London, Dublin, and Paris. With an estimated 95 million Americans expected to travel in the coming days, experts say the best times to avoid heavy traffic are in the evening and the early morning, right? about now. The longer you wait during the rest of the day, more people are just going to be filtering on the road. So if you can get a good jump start on the holiday, you'll be out ahead of the crowd. Some cities with typically heavy traffic are expected to be even more congested than usual, including L.A., Seattle, Houston, Atlanta, and Boston. It takes us three hours. It takes us three hours. We're there for the weekend. We'll have a good, good old time. So some travelers are planning ahead. And then we're actually going to go back on Sunday, so we're not dealing with the Monday traffic. And with the roads expected to be packed, experts are urging motorists to drive with patience to avoid what's become a nationwide problem, road rage. A new survey finds the most confrontational drivers are in Arizona, followed by Rhode Island, West Virginia, Virginia, and Oklahoma. If you're looking for polite drivers, head to Delaware. They're nice there. And many drivers are getting a break at the gas pump. Average gas prices now $3.82 a gallon per AAA. That's close to the same time a year ago. Meanwhile, the holiday rush is on at the airports. The TSA expecting to screen more than 14 million passengers this weekend. It was not your imagination if you were in airports this summer. 227 million people, two and a half million a day. That's going to go down as the busiest on record. Guys, I just checked. We've only got 42 flight cancellations right now for the whole country. Things are looking pretty good today if you're flying. If you're driving, get out there early. This is heavy traffic already. Back to you. All right. Tom Costello for us. Tom, have a great Labor Day weekend, buddy. Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.